this video, I'm gonna show you a monthly maintenance of a sewage treatment plant. Basically, all the ship's poop goes on it. But hey, I get paid three thousand dollars for this. So let's go and let's get dirty. Run. Sewage treatment plant is a system of treating domestic waste containing mainly of household or ship sewage. Physical, chemical, and biological processes are used to remove contaminants and produce treated wastewater called effluent. Effluent that is safe enough to release into environment. On ship, sewage is regulated by Annex 4 of Marple 7378. Blah blah blah. Blah blah blah. Blah, blah, blah. Okay then, your poops travel like this. You drop it, flush it, and it drains to the pipe all the way to the plant. Behind me is a sewage treatment plant! So let me explain. On board, we have a biological type of sewage treatment plant composed of three main compartments. The first section is aeration chamber, where the colony of aerobic bacteria is maintained by supplying air using blower. The sewage is inserted into the first chamber and the aerobic bacteria will decompose the raw sewage into carbon dioxide, water, and inorganic sewage. The air required to sustain the bacteria is supplied via diffuser from the blower. Then, the decomposed sewage from the first compartment goes to the second chamber to separate the sludge and clear liquids by settling. The sludge is again sent back to the first chamber for further decomposition. However, the separated liquids is overflown to the third chamber passing chlorinator in order to disinfect. Now, the collected liquids in the third chamber can be now discharged at sea. So one of my job as an engineer is to maintain this plant. Otherwise, you have a serious trouble. What? Prepare a cold work permit prior starting a job. Discuss the job in the toolbox meeting. Soon as the permit is approved and signed by safety officer, then you can start to work. So, to start with, first we have to bypass the plant. Take out the padlock, break the seal, and change over the valve. Now, the sewage treatment plant is not in service. Uh. Then proceed to the plant and pump out the three tanks. The aeration chamber, the clarifier or settling tank, and the chlorination tank. Moments later, when those three chambers are emptied, stop the air blower and open its manholes. Run. Almost done. Aeration chamber is clean. Let's dose waste treatment enhancer, a biological substance we use which contains specialized bacterial strain which is helpful in degradation of black or gray water and seaweed soil. Just then. This is a clean clarifier chamber. So during a normal operation, solid particles are suctioned on this plate and sent back to the aeration chamber, while pure liquids are overflowing to the chlorinator and collected to this tank called chlorination chamber. Now that all tanks are clean and inspected, let's test high-level alarm by lifting this float switch. Moments later, cleaning finish, we can now close all manholes and fill up with water. More moments later, put back all bulbs in normal position, check air blower oil, grease, and air filter. Uh. Those chlorine tablets in the chlorinator, then start the air blower and discharge pump from manual to auto. Then change over the three bulb from overboard to the plant. Install a company seal and padlock. Now, our sewage treatment plant is back in service. Wow! 
5 minutes later. Record the remove and install seal in the logbook and close the job order in the PMS. Hiya! If you like this video, try to watch some more. It's free and informative. Also, please like and share. It means a lot to me. And if you haven't yet subscribed, please hit that subscribe button. It's totally free. As well as ring that bell button so you may get notified for the upcoming updates.